closing the door so that I don't get a copyright infringement for TV. Um, what's going on guys? It's early AF in the morning. I've been up since like 4 a.m. Um, it's Shantae Marie here. I'm a lifestyle vlogger here on YouTube and I make content that can help you guys out in some way, shape, or form. So let's address the elephant in the room. My hair is gone. I'm probably gonna talk about that later. Um, but I am getting ready to brush my teeth and wash my face so that I can go to the gym. And honestly, I have not worked out in over, way over a month. Uh, there's just been so much going on that it is basically taken a back seat. And I've gained like the COVID 800 for real. So I'm gonna get start getting ready and then we have to get uh, my daughter ready to go to daycare and then we are going to make our way to the gym. Left home in West LA, I'm not excited. So Ever baby. Ever. Hey. Good morning. Good morning, Shuggy Bug. It's okay. We gotta get up so you can go to daycare. Here, mama. On my way to play the bay while you're alone. This girl's a wonder. She loves me, yeah, she needs to know I love her. I wonder if we'll make it through this summer. Just you ready to go to daycare? Cause we late. Cause of you. <laughs> back when we were younger. Yeah. Why don't you love me, love me, love me? Touch me, touch me, touch me, mama. So we just got to the gym. I'm slightly nervous because I haven't been in so long. Um, I just, there's just some things about the gym that kind of give me anxiety, which is really crazy because you guys know that like I've gone to the gym for years now. I just think since having my daughter and trying to get like back on track, it's just been honestly really unsuccessful so far. And like, honestly, I'm really embarrassed of the way that I look right now. And it's nothing that like the average person I feel like would be able to notice just from looking at me on their own but like obviously I see myself when I get in the shower and whatnot and you're clearly way more critical on yourself as well I'm just not proud of myself so um, I'm trying to get back in the swing of things and I figured I would take you guys with me on this journey I am gonna try to think of some sort of creative name um, so that I can vlog this experience with you cuz like this mom's gotta get back This is me. We just finished the workout. I'm celebrating with a cup of iced coffee. 
Um, I really wish that it was warm coffee, but iced is what I bought this time. Hello. I ended up um, doing 30 minutes of cardio, y'all. I couldn't even like run more than like half a mile without stopping and walking. So we only ended up doing two miles. Um, and the fact that it took 30 minutes for me to get two miles, like that's sad, bro. That's sad, that's sad. So then we proceeded into the workout area and I ended up like, I'm just really weak right now. It's just pathetic. Um, and I got really uncomfortable because there was like two older men in there and they just stare at me and I'm like, I had a mask on so literally all you could see was like this and then clearly I'm not wearing my usual gym attire like I'm not wearing what I would normally wear to the gym because I'm not comfortable in any of my workout attire because I purchased all of it when I was super in shape and like I've had a baby so um yeah the workout honestly I feel like I did probably work out good and th better than I'm giving myself credit for. Um, I just feel like I'm really going to have to take it easy going back into this because I just don't, I don't want to like make myself hurt to the point of just not wanting to do anything. And also like tomorrow's Thanksgiving. So like after Thanksgiving, like it's on like Donkey Kong, you know what I mean? Stop eating out, <laughs> start working out. <laughs> I just need to get it together. I need to get on my computer and check some emails for work and make sure there's nothing that like is adamant that I need to do right now. But we also received an order this morning bright and early. I was up at 4.30 and at like 5 a.m. I got a notification from Shopify that someone had ordered off of my website. So if you guys don't know, before I was pregnant, I had started to create a website for my crochet items. And if you guys didn't know, I crochet, I've just always done it as a hobby and I'm just way better at it than I used to be. And I was like, yeah, I might start selling some things here and there. And I've just had some things that were pretty popular that I was like, yeah, I might create a website and like sell these because people like handmade items. So um, I put it on the back burner um, while I was pregnant because it was, I had so much going on. I had so much going on. Uh, I had so much going on. And anyways, the website is still the same. I had launch day two days ago and for real, for real, I, um, <laughs> I actually sold out of all but one head warmer. And, uh, so the website looks pretty bare, but I am going to, basically it takes me about a week to get up enough stock to like put on there. But since people are shopping for the holidays, I obviously am willing to take custom orders, but the custom order head warmers are on there. Um, so if that's something you're interested in, they're on the website. I'll have all the information linked below. But first things first, I need to take a shower. Um, I need to wash my hair. I did cut my hair. I said I would talk about this later, probably in another video. It's never been this short. My hair was like down to here and I cut it. Oh my goodness. Why is it so freaking dark? It's so freaking dark. I'm about to plug in a light. <laughs> I literally just put a, like a soft light box. <laughs> right heel. Um, clearly. We are on hold right now um, with PayPal. It said the wait was one and a half hours to two hours and 53 minutes. Just say three. Just say three. Just say three. Because I'm probably going to end up hanging up with this phone call. Um, anyway, so I got an order last night. I'm about to pack it so that I can get it shipped out today since Thanksgiving is tomorrow. This is my hair curly. Not a fan but it's okay. I just need it to grow a little bit before I can rock this look. I don't have very much time to pack this order, but I wanted to show you guys. Every time that I make something, I like put them in these cellophane, cellophane um, little container bag situations. Um, but I had made these two head warmers. This is a Kansas City Chiefs one and this is a KU one because those are really popular where I'm from so 
Um, these are actually, I have one left. So I have to get to work on back stocking my store. Um, so we sold out in two days, two days. They're not supposed to, she's not supposed to be in here. So um, I also am very excited because I've like done stuff to my house and been able to just really like get things under control. So I'm hoping that this will gain enough financial success for me to be able to just do little things here and there. Like I bought new flooring for the house. There's no longer carpet in any room except for my bedroom and I'm gonna be redoing that next. So that's cool. But I also purchased these little tags and on the other side of them, it gives um, the care instructions. And I also purchased these tags that my logo are on so they look like super puffy and most people sell these for like $25 but mine are 15 so if you guys are looking for Christmas gifts super cheap super easy you can get on my website you can literally order any team that you want you don't even have to do sports teams you can just do colors that you like um, but I like I said I have custom one a custom shop button on my store so check out the link we are going to pack these and make a TikTok video so that I can post that on the TikTok page for rainy days. That's pretty much all we're gonna do for today. I am going to let you guys go. I will be vlogging Thanksgiving though, so stay tuned. I appreciate you guys just hanging out until your girl was ready to come back to YouTube. If you guys haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button and don't forget to thumbs up this video and leave me a comment down below on what you guys are doing for Thanksgiving. I would love to know since you're my YouTube family, I would love to know. So I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Why don't you love me like